I want to start this talk where I start every talk, which is uh, from the point of view of our customers. Every CIO we talk to tells us that they face the twin imperatives of going faster and doing it for less, agility and efficiency, although sometimes they call it different things. My new favorite phrase is the square of despair. I'm going to start using that one. Um, agility to them means that they have to go build more applications and do it on a faster cadence than ever before just to keep up with their competition. Now, they look to cloud computing as the answer. But what is cloud computing to them? It really is a combination of several drivers, each one of them representing an order of magnitude improvement over traditional or legacy IT. Now, a lot of these drivers were born in the, in the public cloud, but every business that we talk to wants to realize these benefits, whether they're running their infrastructure on public clouds or in their private clouds on their own infrastructure. Now, taken together, all these drivers, all these order of magnitude improvements, really confer upon the people who use them an insurmountable competitive advantage over the ones who don't. And that is the business case that's driving the transformation to a hybrid cloud platform for our customers. So let's dive into some of these specific drivers. The first is the move to empower developers with a self-service experience. Gone are the days where developers kind of throw code over the fence to operators who then take weeks or maybe even longer to go provision those applications. Now developers have a self-service experience for doing that in minutes. Next is automation, the idea of offering the platform capabilities as REST APIs so that developers can script them and automate the replication of running systems in minutes as opposed to doing it in a manual and error-prone way over days. And once you have these two things, you can build continuous integration, continuous delivery pipelines, or CICD pipelines, which are really basically automating the build, test, deploy uh, cycle for developers. Once you actually drive down the cycle time and are able to deploy applications many times a week, that means that you can learn faster what your customers want, and you can move faster. And then finally, the move to a microservices architecture from these monolithic systems enables you to go stitch together applications from discrete components over well-defined APIs. And microservices and containers go hand in hand. Containers boot up in seconds as opposed to minutes that VMs take to boot up. And you can run hundreds of them on a server compared to only tens of VMs. Again, order of magnitude improvements. Now, all these taken together, again, drive insurmountable competitive advantages for businesses who use them over businesses who don't. Now, we chose Cloud Foundry as the PaaS framework for unlocking these benefits for our customers, because Cloud Foundry is the industry standard, multi-vendor, open source, PaaS platform and ecosystem. We've been a member of the Cloud Foundry Foundation since its inception uh, as a platinum founding member, and we've taken a deep dependency on Cloud Foundry in our products. And Helion Staccato is our multi-cloud, enterprise-grade, cloud-native application platform. The product is now in its fifth year, and version 4.0, which is shipping in just a few short weeks, is going to be 100% Cloud Foundry Foundation certified. Uh, back to Sam's point about certification, which we take very seriously. So we'd like to help you go faster with Cloud Foundry and Staccato and help you realize those order of magnitude improvements to agility that come from the cloud. So come find us at our booth, and maybe I'll even do some martial arts demonstrations there. Thank you.